everyone. Thank you for tuning in. I have a, not a huge Erin Condren haul, but it's a big Erin Condren haul, bigger than what I usually order. I got my $100 off code because if you did not know, if you place more than 20 orders with Erin Condren, you get a $20 off code. I mean, $100 off code. There used to be the fifth order and 10th order. They did away with those. Um, so now you get the hundred dollar off code if you spend if you buy why can I talk if you place more than 20 orders okay so if you get that remember all right you have to contact them through Facebook or customer service to get the code it's automatically come to you and when you do you have to use it all at once it's not like you know a typical gift card where you have money left over you have to use it all at once so I made sure I had enough items and I expedited the shipping because if you did not know the day I'm filming this in a week, I'm going to Tokyo. So I wanted to make sure I had it here in time because there's some things in here that I want to take with me. So yeah, this is just covering my address. I got this with another haul that you guys saw. So let's get started. Okay, let me um, move this out of the way. And I also have address labels in here, so I'm gonna have to cover those up too. Um, so let's just open this up. Let's take this, oh my God. All right, you know what? I will just put everything, I'll just take it stuff out. Okay, I got some, there was some stuff I was like, I've been wanting and I was going to get one of the, another one of the smaller tote bags. And I was like, you know what? No, get a, get a, a bundle of stuff that you've been wanting. That way, you know, you'll have it, it'll be out of the way. So. I'm just moving some stuff around. All right. Okay. All right. Okay. I'm not going to show the address label for obvious reasons, but um, I will show the design that I got. Okay. So I guess first, okay, let me see. I want to show the, the labels. Oh my God. How am I going to do this? Okay. So. <laughs> It's just the triangle overlay for the teacher, like they came up with the teacher line last year, and it has my name and address on it. I just got it because, you know, whenever I sell things on Mercari and I send them off, you know, I like to put like little thank you notes or whatever, or if I'm sending happy mail to someone, and that's what it is. But I mean, that's pretty much all I can show without you guys just trying to stalk me. All right, so yeah, I do really like how they came out though. I'll show Jamie, she knows where I live, okay. Okay, so with that said, let's get started i want to show the covers first i got some covers i ordered four covers because why not i don't think you can have too many or aaron contra covers i think the more the better because you can just switch off and ever so yeah i love it all right so this one i had been wanting for a very long time and excuse this this nail popped off i wasn't i got other shit going on in my life right now all right my husband told me home from the hospital today so Yes. All right. This is the teacher cover and you can get like your, you know, it says Mrs. Or you can put your first name on here. I, I love it. I design, I have a folder on my computer of all the Aaron Contra covers I've designed and I just screenshotted them that way. When I'm looking for a new cover, I go to that. And when I buy it, I just delete it. And that, that's a good idea for anybody who's like, who wants to go, who can't decide what covers go through and make your covers, screenshot them. That way you can remember like the color scheme and all of that stuff and you go back to it. So this is, oh my God, I love this. Mrs. Ennis, minder of her own business. This is so cute. This is so cute. I love it. And that's what it looks like right there. So yeah, I told you I had new covers coming when I did my Erin Condren. It says 2020, 2021. So I hate that it's dated. I do. I mean, but it does go all the way to next year. I mean, I may be tired of it, but I didn't, I didn't have the option to take this off. But I just thought that was really, really cute. Okay, and the next one is the new one for Valentine's Day. And I did the typical Valentine's Day colors. I just thought it was really cute. I mean, you can use it beyond, you know, Valentine's Day. But I just, I didn't have a, like a red cover. So I really wanted one and I thought it was cute. So I got that. Really nice. Okay. And then the next cover... Is one I have been liking for, oh no, I got five covers. Five covers, okay, I thought I got four, we got five. All right, this one right here, I really love. You can get it with a black background, but I knew I didn't, I don't have a cover with, well, yes I do, let me stop lying. 
I don't have one like this, but I do have one with like a lighter background. But this is, I thought this was really cute with the watercolor of the birds. And there we go right there. Looks like this. There we go. And that's the back of it right there. And this next one, I saw Julie Plants. And I didn't even know my friend Jamie had the same one because um, she loves polka dots. And I saw Julie Plans with this. She has like a like a peachy pink color of hers and I thought it was just really cute and so I had to get it. And I got this one. You only could put like your, you know, the acronym initials on there. I was just gonna do KI, but it looks better with the with the middle initial. And my middle my middle name starts with the D. And so I just thought it was really cute and it's something I don't have anything like in my collection. I just thought it was really nice, very professional looking. Looks like this. You know, I don't really have a lot of neutral covers. You know, I, I usually like like pastels or bold and bright or whatever. So I really do like this. And my last cover is this one right here. This is one where you can like choose your entire quote. And it looks like this. And I, I don't know where this quote is from, but I heard Jake Gyllenhaal say it in an interview. The job of the artist is to disturb the uncomfortable and comfort the disturbed. And I loved it ever since I heard him say it. And I, I just really like the, I like the quote because here's the thing, you know, you gotta get uncomfortable in order to grow. You really do. You have to get uncomfortable in order to grow. So I like this. I thought it was simple. I like the pink splatter. It looks like a typewriter. Really nice, very simple. And I love the mint green behind it. And there's the back of it right there. So very nice. So th those are the covers. I'll be putting these on the coil as soon as I'm done with the video. All right. So those are the covers. Next up, what I got is a kaleidoscope strap for the tote. And I am taking my larger tote with me to Japan. And so I was like, I want a brand new strap to take along with me. And that is exactly what I did. I ordered this kaleidoscope strap and I just think it's gorgeous. I remember when Aaron Condren first came out with this, I was like, I want it. I'm glad I held off because now I have to pay for it. All right. So this is the kaleidoscope, kaleidoscope strap and it's gorgeous. Oh my God, it's so pretty. Wow. I think it would even look good on the black bag as well because of these bright bold colors on the black bag. Really nice. Really, really nice. Love it. I think Jamie has the strap because she told me it was gorgeous in person so I assume she has it. Oh, it's just so pretty. I love it. It, it looks even better in person. She told me about that. She's like, it looks even better in person. All right, so that is the kaleidoscope strap. I will be putting on the, this on my bag as soon, not as soon, but before I get ready to go. Okay, and so two more things. <laughs> um, I got this, I don't know, three more things. Four, actually. One item is free that I got. I guess if you order so much stuff, you got something for free. But I got a reusable bag. I love um, the reusable bag that I have. I keep it in my purse. Um, when I went to Vegas last summer, my friend Desiree gave me one full of a bunch of planner stuff. And I did not know I would use that bag as much as I do. It's great when I go to like, you know, Rite Aid, plan on picking up a couple things. And we have a bag policy here that they charge you for bags in California. So it's great when you go plan to get a couple things, you can get more. But we're going to Japan and we're gonna be doing shopping and everything. And so I wanted bags where I can easily carry in my purse that I can use if we're, you know, picking up souvenirs or whatever. And I got this one. The color is, I really like it. Really, really nice. I'm just gonna throw this in my suitcase, you know, when we get ready to go. And these bags are very sturdy. They're very sturdy. They hold a lot. And the fact that you can just roll them up and put them in your bag, this is, yeah. So yeah, they have one like a yellow color, I believe, and then like a mint green color. But yeah, I got this bag specifically to take with Japan. Take with Japan, take to Japan. But I mean, it'll be great because I'll throw it in my, I'll keep it in my purse when we come back and um, use it, you know, for other stuff. And I love, I mean, these are some very, I didn't know they were this sturdy, but they are very, I've carried like two liters in here. Very, very nice. I'll roll it up later. Okay, so something else that I got, this. When I saw this accordion bag come out of these pouches, I was just like, planner supplies, really? I mean, like, but no, I was like, oh my God purse organizer, traveling. And so this is my first time ever going out of the country. I know, you know, I'm uncultured. Um, and so I wanted something that where it can keep everything together, but different categories. And so I thought this would be great to, you know, use to 
you know, go out of town and oh my God. Oh no, there's like a stitch coming. Look at that, look at that. Oh no. I, let me see. It looks like it's just that part. I, here's the thing. Like, yeah, should I be doing that? No. Um, but my thing is this is that I do not have time to like send it back. And it's one of those things that could I live with it? You know? Like I'm I, I'm trying not to pull it apart, but I'm pulling to see if it does. I don't, you know what? I think it's gonna be fine. So anyway. You guys know I'm honest here. So it comes apart like that. And I'm going to use it for toiletries and little travel things that I'll be picking up um, before we go out of town. Like I can put the girls' toothbrushes in here. I can have a bag dedicated for each of them. Um, you know, like the toothbrush, toothpaste or whatever. And yeah. But I am not too... Let me check the rest of them. Oh, just looks like a little bit of quality control problem. Over here, no, oh, like right here too. Like, what is this? Wow, huh, that kind of sucks. Yeah, I just, uh, okay. <sighs> I am gonna contact them about this because like that should not be doing that at all. I'm gonna contact them. I mean, because the way air conscious service, I've never had an issue. Um, they'll probably just send another one out. But yeah, I'm just going to take a picture and send this to them and let them know what's going on because it should not be doing that. So yeah, that kind of sucks. But I mean, I do want to use it. <laughs> so um, the thing I got for free was this gratitude journal. And it was either this or the goals one. And I already have a goals planner. And so I did not want to get another goals planner. So let's open this up. I was like, I'm not a person who really writes. I mean, I I have intentions when I start gratitude stuff, and then I just I'm, I'm not a person who sits down and says, "What am I grateful for today?" You know, it's just not me. So this is edition two. So this is what it looks like right here. Ways I connected today. What I love about this time of year, lessons I learned today. What I found, what I focused on today, cute things I saw today. See, this is like, this is like prompts. I just, um, ways I love myself today, fun things I did today, people I'm grateful for. Oh, so you can just use it each day. And this is the prompt just to help you. Okay, all right, that makes sense. Okay, so there's different prompts in here that you can use for each day. I mean, or whenever you feel like it. It's not dated, so there's no pressure there that you have to write it every single day. So I do kind of like that. And I, I like the prompt because in the, if you don't have anything to write about it, you do have something here. So, also you, you get 30 prompts. So it's meant for you to write every single day, but you don't have to. And you have 30 day reflection, my favorite moments, things I learned, ways I've gotten grown, ways I've grown, 30 observations, goals and intentions, looking forward. Okay, the next 30 days, I don't know how many, let's see how many months you get in here. Okay, so that's two months. It probably says it on the damn thing. Six months, okay. Six months of unique daily gratitude prompts, 30 reflections, six months reflection, six month planning spread. Illustrative metallic sticker sheet. Okay, there's a sticker sheet in here. Okay, so you get six months, which is cool, which is a good amount. And these are the stickers right here. This it's really pretty though. The designs in the book is pretty. Okay, so these are the stickers right here. Really nice. I like the color scheme of it. It's not too cheesy or anything like that. Really like that. Okay. All right. Okay, so I am probably just gonna put this in my petite because I am be I will be taking my petite um, with me to um, Japan, and I think this will be a great way to start it, you know, in Japan, you know, because I'm leaving on the 29th, so I'm I'm leaving like kind of at the beginning of the month, um, so and then you know February is a short month anyway, so I will not be lost on 
you know, props. So yeah, really pretty. The last thing I want to show, because I have to flip through it, is the the sticker book, the 12 month um, where you has the monthly spreads in here. And I've been wanting one of these forever, but I was just like, do I want to spend my money on it? <laughs> so yeah, all right. So here we go. All right, so this is, says add a little confetti to each day. Looks like this. And there is January. So I'll start using this for February because I have not decorated February yet. So this is really cute. And this is February. So I use these for the month. I would, my goal was like use this for the, you know, for the monthly spreads. Cause you know, it's not a ton of stickers. It's just enough. And I just like it because they're all like seasonal. And this is March, really cute. I've heard people say it's not enough for the weekly spread. This would be enough for a weekly spread. You throw, look, I'll throw some Simply Go to Washington on there and call it a day. But um, I think people who say that are the type of people who use like full on kits for their weeks. And so if you're that type of planner, of course this wouldn't be enough for you. But for me, I couldn't make it stretch if I were using it on a weekly spread. But um, I'll be using it for my monthlies. And this is April. And I'll probably just keep it in my planner in the pocket. May, I love, I love peach. I know Julie Plans hates peach, but I love peach. <laughs> so here is June, July. This will be in my new planner because I'm pretty sure, you know, I'll be getting a new planner come May. All right, August. And then we have September, October, November, and December. And that is the book. Okay, so I like this little book. I like, you know, it's just a few stickers to decorate the month. So that is everything that I got. I am gonna contact Erin Condren about this, this pouch. You know, I've always had good customer service. I'll probably just send another one out. Um, I doubt they'll ask me to send this back. I'm just gonna send them pictures of how it looks and be like, hey, I ordered this and this is like not acceptable. And it's okay, you know, there's no need to drag them. You know, <laughs> unless I need to, but I doubt it. But yeah, that is that. We got this, the gratitude book, and I got all of my covers. All right, we got my covers right here. All that good stuff. All right, and yeah, cover, cover, cover. All right. Oh, and the kaleidoscope strap, the bag. And then my address labels that I can't show. All right, so thank you guys for tuning in. And for everybody who sent well wishes, thank you. I really, really appreciate it. It's been a rough week. So thank you guys for the support. If you are not subscribed, go ahead and do that. If it's your first time as an Aaron Conjun customer, I do have a link down below. If you click on it and purchase, you will get $10 off of your first purchase. And you can create your own link, okay? So anybody who uses your link can get $10 off and you get a $10 off coupon. All right. And so with that said, I'm going to get out of here and I will see you all later. Bye.